It's back. Thank you for replacing my rod, Daiwa. I appreciate it. So I've been running around like a madman these last couple days. I just got back from Briary Creek. I've been up since 6 a.m. I edited day two of that video. Should be up on YouTube by now. I'm going to fish a pond that I haven't fished in a very long time. So I used to fish this three or four times a week in high school. Um, it's produced some, you know, three and four pounders. Nothing truly giant, but then again, I haven't fished there in probably five years. So I'm going to go hit that up. I have two hours to fish it. I hope I don't get skunked. It's 95 degrees outside, 1230 in the afternoon. Terrible conditions, but hopefully I'll get on something. So let's get out right, there. Guys, I just got down to the pond. I brought two rods with me. Seven foot medium carrot stick spinning rod and the zillion, which I just got back. I have a shaky head, zoom trick worm and a little swim bait on. Hoping that I can get some action. Water looks pretty dirty. Got some good storms last night. I'm gonna throw the zillion first because I've missed it so much. So light. This is my favorite rod of all time. It's amazing. I'm not really expecting much here. It's the middle of the day. It's almost 100 degrees outside. I'm going to fan cast this area, see if I can pick anything up. The goal for the day is just not to get skunked. I will take any size fish. So when I'm throwing this swim bait, I'm letting it sink to different depths. Kind of figuring out what these fish want just covering as much of this water as i can fan casting kind of everywhere giving it lots of twitches and pops trying to get a reaction strike out of these fish luckily i ended up on a windblown bank which is pretty sweet it's also shaded which nowhere else in this pond looks to be shaded at all. So maybe I'll be able to pick one off. Oh. I just missed one right there. <laughs> if it was a fish, it was very small. So I'm fishing the deepest bank in this pond. I figured it would be the best chance of me catching a fish. It's shaded. It has some wind blowing against it. Should be able to catch some fish here. Because I just fan casted this entire area. Did not get bit. Gonna walk down a little bit towards the dam. Maybe they're holding in some deeper water. Come on fish. I know there's some in here. I only need one. I only need one. Pond hopping really makes me miss my boat. <laughs> Especially only being 5'5", five five, walking through all this kind of stuff. It's not the easiest task. Ah. Hey, when all else fails, you go fish the fountain. <laughs> Guys, so unfortunately, no fish. I was completely skunked. This pond was a bust. I did pick the worst time of day to come fishing, but I didn't really have much of a choice. So I'm on my way to work. I might try to find a pond that has some light and fish tonight. Otherwise, Ace is taking over tomorrow. He's gonna be fishing the Aquaquan Reservoir with his girlfriend. Thank you for watching. I know this video is probably a little bit boring, but I'm just showing you that we're putting the effort in to fish every single day and post a video every single day. So, hope you at least got something out of this. See you tomorrow.